Hello everyone, Carl here. Today I'm going to talk about the movie on Netflix called Vampires vs. the Bronx. Let's first of all talk about the plot. It's about a bunch of vampires that try to take over the Bronx, New York and free Free friends. Get curious and decide to uh, investigate it on their own ha own hands, and they find out that there's a real estate guy trying to become a vampire himself, and he's basically a familiar, which is. human trying to eventually become a vampire by being a vampire servant didn't earn it and they actually are staying in the courthouse in the Bronx in the movie and it's a pretty good plot I get the plot about 7 out of 10 it's not as good a plot as classic vampire movies like Lost Boys and Blade Etc. Um, the characters, I give them a 10 out of 10 because I can relate with them. Which are the three main kids. And they did a good, good job with the makeup of the vampires. So I give it uh, maybe 7 out of 10 for that too. Not as good as Blade or The Lost Boys, though, obviously. Um, what can I say about the movie? Well, it's overall movie grade. I have to give it a C plus, just because I prefer classic vampire movies. But I still really enjoyed this fun vampire movie. It was fun to watch. Um, so let me know what you watch this yes or no. I don't want to say too much about it about giving out the entire movie. So let me know when you watch it. Let me know what you think about the movie Vampires for Sprocks. All right, thank you for watching and have a good day. Bye now.